change of plans. Day five? Day five, end of day five. So, little story, it's already in the afternoon. The plan for today was to go to the Bayreuther Hütte, but Aletta wasn't feeling that well today, so... No, I had some stomach pains and I was very details, but... <laughs> 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 but it was better for me to just stay at like a shadow place and just chill out for the day. Yeah. So we did a short hike of only 45 minutes to an hour. Yeah, 45 minutes. Uh, the place where we yeah. stayed last night didn't have any uh, rooms uh, available anymore, so we decided, okay, we had a couple of options. We can either go to the Bayreuther Hütte, which was like a day walking and Aletta wasn't feeling great, go back to the valley where there were a lot of tourists and we didn't like that to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually found um, like on the map on all trails like a little alm, Dalvas alm. Dalvas alm, close enough. <laughs> yeah, we're at the Dalvas alm, which is like it was, like Aletta said, it was 45 minutes uh, from where we stayed last night. It was a beautiful hike though. It was like with all views uh, on the Achensee and the other mountains we hiked through the last couple of days. So it was a pretty hike and I liked the path as well. Yeah, yeah, so we got here in the morning and I think Aletta got a little bit of sleep. Well, a little bit. When we got here and then left, I fell immediately in sleep. So I slept for two hours and then I woke up and I was like, okay, I need to go outside. And I enjoyed the sun in complete silence, yeah. <laughs> looking at the mountains. Yeah, while Aletta was sleeping, I did a little solo hike, which I will show you. All right, I'm going on a little solo tour. Started here. I don't have any plan. But I think you can see the mountain over there. If it's doable, I'm going there. And otherwise I will just see where I go. Okay, so my goal is to get up there and I walk over this ridge. Ridge, 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 ridge. And maybe I can climb down there. I'm not sure, but I will see. Zigzagging up. I'm at 2200 meters height and the view is breathtaking. I think I'm going to hike this trail. But I'm not sure if there's a way down, so I have to figure that out over there and otherwise I'll go back and maybe go to that cross if you see it. Both trails look really awesome, so looking forward to it. We're waiting on a dog to pass here. <laughs> and super model. <laughs> Woo! Super dog! How many Berge did you steigen? 300! 300! Insgesamt! And 3000er! Wow! So this dog will be in the September uh, edition of Vogue and her name is Janelle. If a little dog can do it, I can do it. Almost at the summit. So the last bit is pretty easy. Pretty easy walking. So there was a bit with cables, but it's very, was okay. And this part is really easy, just a little climb up and then I'm there. Look at this view. What? It's crazy. What I really love about hiking. You meet a lot of cool people and if you are somewhere that you want to change plans you're able to change plans and yeah have a crazy beautiful summit. Yeah, that's what I really love about it. Like the freedom of going wherever you want. 
especially when the weather is this beautiful. So I'm now going to the other side. I met a couple of guys said it was pretty easy. There are some ropes that you have to climb down, but like steel cables, that's what I mean. Well, first have a look and then decide. So we're here, this is a cable and that's the top and the fact that I'm alone is the reason I won't be doing this. Maybe if I brought all my climbing gear I would have done it but for now I will be smart because next week I will have a climbing course in Italy and that's a little bit more important to me so I will skip this part and go back. Okay, I'm back at the hut. It was a solo hike today. The reason Aleta got hit by a stomach bug, poor Aleta. That's why I chose to go on a solo hike. I hope she feels better now. So we'll have a look. I'm almost at the cabin where she will be waiting. So yeah, that's also part of being uh, like a, a hikeaholic. So you have to adapt. When somebody's not feeling well, you have to adapt and change plans. Our original plan was to hike for two more days the other direction. So now we did a little hike here. I did a long solo hike. So now it's the end of the day. And tomorrow we, and for tomorrow we will see if Aleta feels good. We can hike down here. And otherwise we'll take the cable car back and back to the valley. To Seyfeld in Tyrol. Seyfeld in Tyrol. <laughs> 